Let's now with the Fox Cities. Today is Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Day, a time to remember the slain civil rights leader and all he stood for. And one of those celebrations took place at Appleton East High School. Local 5's Chris Schuler has more on this first annual day of service. We shall all be free. At Appleton East High School, the first of its kind celebration, a day of service honoring the life and legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. We should talk about him and remember him and talk about the good things that he did, positive things that he did. From the auditorium to the hallways, people packed the facility where 50 nonprofits set up shop, encouraging attendees to volunteer and serve others in the tradition of Dr. King. Serving. Coming together collaboratively to serve is a huge part of the message that he left with all of us. He believed in every aspect of social justice, and one way to do that is to give back to our community. This first annual event came at the urging of the community, eager to find a way to give residents time to observe Martin Luther King Jr. Day, a federal holiday until now not recognized by the school district with a day off. Allowing for the kids to have that day as a day not attending school so they can have the opportunity to, to, to do what's critical and have a event here in the local community. So in July, the city of Appleton joined forces with the school board to create the day of service celebration to give students and families the opportunity to volunteer on MLK's birthday. This is an historic day in the city of Appleton. It's outstanding. I mean, you can see the, the excitement behind us and you see the things happening. I think it's for the first year it's really coming together very well. A day to honor the civil rights leader's life and his continued impact on the world. If it wasn't for him, I don't know if we'd be here today, where we are today. A gathering that brought out hundreds, all eager to carry on his call for service. Someday. Reporting in Appleton, Chris Schuler, Local 5 News.